Hi everyone and welcome back. So today we are gonna build up this lovely relaxation area for the beavers. So uh, district center is finally gonna move in here as well. We've got some beautification done on the mountain. We've got rooftop terraces on the platforms hanging off so they are pretty high up here and uh, underneath we've got uh, campfires finally as well. So basically a whole lot of different ways and things for beavers to do. After it is the evening again we've even got some double showers in here. So swimming pools and we're starting to plant some trees as well so yeah let's get straight to it and see how everything will come together so before we construct up this relaxation area for for the beavers i do have to go through a couple of things here real quick so uh, we've lost a bit of our construction again and uh, in here i i don't know how but somehow when i was preparing for this episode i accidentally deleted this uh, one levy over here and we lost the bridge as well so yeah that's gonna have to go back in there and then um right now it's not really linked up so this area is not very very lovely i, I mean there's no reason for them to really come up here except for this spot over here all right he's doing his little run and uh yeah we, we're just trying to get the let's give you a slightly higher priority so it's gonna be done a little bit quicker but uh, yeah we've, we've got some terrain blocks that we still need to put in but once it's done we'll delete this ladder in here and we can put the decorations there back in place all right then uh what else i have paused all the the sand or dirt production because our storages are full and since we're not really constructing anything then uh yeah that can go on pause until further notice everything else i think we are pretty good in here so so yeah we we do have a, quite a few spare beavers as well so we're just gonna let them kind of like relax and um yeah just just do nothing for the time being but okay to um develop this area i think we're just gonna focus on this mountain top in here oh dear night time is arriving so why don't we skip that real quick and there we go so for the planning phase uh, we are gonna have to bring up i think a few more pillars over here not really sure we might even actually want to pause this for uh, a little bit okay so we've got stairs in here as well um, yeah, let's bring you up a little bit. We'll use a few natural tiles. I believe that should be the height that we that we need. You guys are probably going to have to go a little bit higher. Let's just bring it up all the way for the time being. And see how far do we have to go. Now, platforms are going to be needed. We definitely want everything to be at, at height here. Oh, yeah. Okay, so maybe a third one here okay yeah this one's gonna go here and i think that should be kind of enough i hmm okay what we are actually gonna do let's uh bring them down by one level we don't really want it yeah same height as our main sort of highway that we have in here we kind of want it to to feel like it's it's out of place or or just to this side it's not like the the main attraction if, if that makes sense okay so you maybe you are gonna make this one a little bit shorter as well and the idea over here is okay maybe this will be fine as well let me just have a look we might change it around a little bit but um what we want to place up here is most likely gonna be hold on a second okay so this one might be too short let's do a little bit longer Okay, here we go. Rooftop terrace goes here. And then what we can do, we can do, yeah, a bit of vegetation as well. Okay, I'd like to bring this just a little bit further again. Okay, we can do place you over there. That's going to be pretty, pretty far out though. Okay, how about we change you around? Yeah, it's going to take a little bit of time to get it right, but, but once we do then um, this area should be pretty pretty amazing for the beavers okay so well-being again rooftop terrace yeah i think this is gonna be fine in here we can even leave this levee in place uh block you in a little bit like so all right you're gonna have to go lower this one seems to be a little bit too long i mean we could get rid of this pillar which probably is a smarter idea Okay, it's just going to leave us a little bit of extra space there for later, for the future when we might want to place some things on the lower levels. Okay, this one can go, and I don't think we need these levees here either. 
Then what shall we do here? Hmm. Technically, yeah, same thing again. I don't think we need to construct all of those. But it was just good to have them before to sort of like measure things out. Alright, so that one's gonna go here. You can... Oh yeah, we are gonna need you at that height, aren't we? And then... Okay, so that's starting to take shape a little bit. Now the question is, what shall we place here? I mean, we could remove this levee and have the rooftop terraces here instead. So that way... Yeah, this might look a little bit better, actually. And here as well, what I think I'd like to do, if we place the levee here instead, this means we could grab, if we get the right angles as well, we can do a platform or the side platform there, place some uh, some shrubs. Okay, now we just need a road up here as well, and um, yeah, it's starting to look pretty good. Okay, so for the time being, let's just remove the levee. And we can maybe change it up a little bit later, but for now, I think that should be pretty good. Okay, we can resume the time as well. And uh, yeah, you guys can start constructing it straight away. I don't think we have any rooftop terraces in this district now, do we? No, we don't. We just have the lakeside housing over there and a bit of temporary stuff in here, I think. All right, why don't we pause a couple more of you guys? There's... Um, there is some more nicer housing that, that's available to us, so, so yeah, go and use those ones. Okay, now we do want to beautify this area a little bit as well. So showers are already here. I have sort of planned and measured it out. We would like to give them a little bit of privacy here. So, okay, one's going to go there. And then once these ones are done, we can place one in the middle as well. Then swimming pools. You guys are going to go here, and I just kind of wanted it to be sort of tucked away. And yeah, this whole area is looking very empty in here, and something we could probably do is place some trees. Yeah, probably change up these roads in here as well. Okay, just a tiny bit. And to give it a bit more depth, we could do the same right up here. Okay, yeah, with a couple of trees, it's definitely starting to look a little bit better. Then uh, remove those roads as well. And let's have a look. Okay, so you guys are constructing this already. That is wonderful. Isn't this a slightly higher priority though? I mean, that is the main main attraction here, but that's okay. Now, um, over here with the main entrance, that's supposed to be grand and uh, super cool. We... I don't think we're going to go too crazy in here. However, if we can find the decoration section... Okay, so there we go, some braziers. Uh, where would you guys be? I'm thinking that with these levees, we could do a bit of a fire show here with, oh yeah, with the selection of them. If we space them out, could this look pretty cool as well? I don't know, but it might be worth giving it a try. Now, the pacing might be quite important. If we, 150, could do something like so. Okay, and so that's going to leave two white gap, one over here. Actually, why don't we place them down, and then we just figure out the rest. We're just going to pause you for a little bit. Okay, here we go. Um, that's a little bit tricky, but I reckon... Oh yeah, you can't even reach this one. Oh well, we're, we're going to have to approach this from the water, I suppose. And then... I don't know how much privacy they need over here, but that is definitely something we could do as well. Let's just place them down and see what it's going to look like, and then we can we can always change it up a little bit as well. Okay, back to decorations. The other things we have, we have the beaver bust. Okay, how are you going to look like? Let's just grab you again. All right, I'm feeling that these ones should be like here. Oh, yes. That is looking pretty scary stuff. Like, tons of them. I'm not even scared to put quite a few of them down here. Because I think that looks that looks pretty cool. All around, except this side here. Actually, we can, can do it on this side as well. We just need one of those side platforms. So let's place you here. 
and voila, there we go. And then later we're gonna place the district center right in the middle as well. Okay, hmm, what else can we do in here? So with the braziers, I feel we could put a bit of light in here. And it would be cool if we could do the, the other corners as well. Alright, so there we go, we can place one in here, but I... Yeah, I feel like this mountain is a little bit in the way. And I'm completely happy with this. Yeah, so it kind of feels like it's been built into this mountain rather than um, sort of leveled out and, you know, everything, everything's been made perfect. Now, there's one thing that I do want to change with the mountain over here. And it feels like this side is really, really sort of empty. It, there, there's no, there's not much happening in here. And I'd like some stuff to happen over here. What we can do, do we want to... Hmm, I don't want to block this up, if that makes sense. But I do want to raise this area just a little bit. Oh yeah, you seem a little empty, so maybe... Hmm, if we raise this too much, then I don't want it to become stairs. Oh yeah, we have such high requirements, it seems, today. Okay, how about we just build a bit of a ledge over here? And then guess something like this could work as well so it's kind of put away and can even raise this a little bit to make it feel like it's a little bit different that could work I suppose and now all we're gonna do is let me just speed up the time as well we're not gonna skip this night I'm afraid but we are gonna give them stairs over here okay and let's do another platform just to make sure that they can construct everything all right, uh, it seems it seems the beaver busts are already in place. And yeah, I've got to say this looks pretty cool. I'd like to see some of those lights as well. And okay, pretty happy with this, I think. Yep, why don't we just unpause everything in here. Bad tide is approaching. Oh dear, okay, fine. We should be able to get some things done before everything's gonna get crazy all right connect you up with road as well that one should be within the reach now and we probably don't want to unpause this one here because that's gonna block everything all righty there we go now the next question is uh let's bring everything up once again all right there we go so this corner here as well we are gonna need a forester here so let's place you down. Hopefully no one's going to get stuck in there. Or maybe we should... Oh no, there's a tree in the way. So yeah, that, that's fine. We're going to have a forest there. We'll plant a few trees. Maybe some more vegetation over here. But what are some of the other things we could place down? Well, we've got those lanterns as well. But I feel like these are more for um, high traffic areas. Yeah, they don't... I don't think they would look great on this mountain top here. Now the next thing we could probably do is we've got a, quite a few mountain tops and I haven't removed the the access to to those different areas just yet. And that's probably a good thing because I'd like to place a few statues in different locations as well. I think it could make this make this look a little bit more interesting. So for example, right up here we could do one of these statues gonna take quite a bit of metal but that's fine because we have tons or quite a few in the bank it seems yeah and we got four of those stations running as well well five it seems okay yep very good now one's gonna go over here let's do a, another one that's sort of overlooking oh well uh, you don't have access to this area anymore which is a little bit unfortunate we can do one over there and unfortunately we've also removed all the access up on those pillars here as well so a little bit unfortunate i do want to climb up definitely to this one here again as well i mean it's fine i guess we just build or rebuild everything again one more level platform and there we go so that's that it seems the platforms are coming along pretty pretty nicely already so that is fantastic. Now the next thing, let's have a look at this well-being again. And the very first thing we have is campfire. That's uh, that's something we unfortunately don't have in this district just yet. And I think I've got a location where to put them. So um, I don't want to build anything high underneath these platforms. I do want this to look like it's, you know, high up in the mountains. However, these campfires might be pretty good to make the 
this sort of underground or downstairs area look a little bit more busy. Okay, we can maybe... Uh, that's going to be a bit of a Tetris as well, trying to fit them all in. Uh, that could go there. Oh yeah, that's a little bit unfortunate. I mean, actually it's fine. We can space it out a little bit. What do we have over here? Oh, it's difficult to get those right angles. Okay, so how about one like somewhere here, another one here. And these trees, although they're looking great, I think... Actually, hold on a second. If, if they remain over there, we could still build you like so. Now, access-wise, hmm, how should they run over here? Is it from this side of the mountain? Oh, actually, yeah, we could create this interesting road network from here. I don't want to connect up these ladders. Yep, that's just a kind of like an emergency access for us for the time being. Then you can go over there. Oh no. Okay. I see the problem. It would be nicer if they could pass through this area. Okay, all of you are gonna have to go... We'll change you up just a tiny bit. Okay, that's looking better. I don't want them, the access points to be at the same sort of corner and side. Okay, now we're talking. You can go over here. Everything's connected up. I mean, in an ideal world, I'd prefer if there was a bit of a gap in here. Can we achieve this though? Oh, yes, we can actually. So if we cancel you, cancel this one. All right, here we go. Quick tile in here. You guys can go get out of here and let's try this again so you're gonna go here oh hold on a second was that a miscalculation on my behalf or let's try this again okay this road you gotta go we're gonna have a gap over there uh, roads are gonna be difficult that means this uh, barrel over here is gonna be in our way as well or if we move you, now we're going to have a bit of extra space in here. However, they still cannot connect over. Okay. Or maybe we don't want this area to connect up. Maybe. So let's say if we place you over here. Yeah, it's a bit of space in here. And okay, let's say this tile which I'm unable to grab. You're going to go here connect you up and this could work as well right so you guys are complaining that you don't have access but that's because of the road networks let's uh, zoom around real quick so you guys are all built okay i guess it is time to change you up there we go and then we just have to figure out the nightmare situation that we have in here i mean we could probably do let me have a look real quick. So we got those metal reinforced platforms. Well, you can't go there. Because we are also passing power through here, which is a little bit annoying. But hold on a second. If we... I wonder what's underneath this one. Let's have a look. Nothing. So, a normal platform. Okay. I think I have an idea. As soon as this bot runs away... We could probably do some metal platforms in here, like the smallest one on the first level. We'll do one of those uh, straight power shafts as well, to make sure that power still passes over to the other side over there. Alright, here you go, get out of here. And 3 to 1, time. Platform, delete this one as well. They're gonna complain a little bit, but that's okay. Let's grab the small one, big one over here. Oh, yep. Is this what we are looking for? Okay. Roads can be connected up. You can go over here. Bit of a gap in here, but that's fine. These ones can go through as well. Although I'm feeling like we might want to change this around just a tiny bit. Now, this is definitely an area where I'd like to start putting down some more... Maybe some housing as well for the beavers. Are we able to put platforms here? Oh yes we are, so we can continue a little bit. Over or on top of here we can do a few metal platforms again. And then, um, yeah we could have some housing. But uh, let's have a look at this area because it's nighttime. everything's gonna look beautiful. Oh yes it is. 
Now the next question is, this is very, very empty. Um, what else do we have in the decoration section? All right, we definitely love to light this area up as much as we can. These are 100% some of my favorite new things in here. Could give them benches as well. And then uh, let's have a look at this well-being real quick. Oh, okay. No, we can't do this one here. And I don't think those back scratchers really fit the, the vibe in this area. No. You guys aren't able to build this. Oh, that's unfortunate. Well, why don't you get out of the way? Um, yeah, not sure what we can really place in here, to be honest. Unless... Um, Okay, actually, never mind. I take it back. I think I have a rough idea we can do. I know I said we don't want to raise it up too much, but uh, let's have a quick look. So if we do those blocks over there, and then we should have something a little bit... Okay, yep, unlock it. Not so sure about this, to be honest. What about these things in here? Just to kind of fill the, the space a little bit. Okay, there we go. And then, well, yeah, of course, we still have to put something else down in here. Uh, roofs will be kind of weird, I guess. Could do a few flowers in here. Let's put a couple of benches. Let's leave it like this for, for a little bit. Let, let's see what happens. Okay, now the section's gonna go here. Maybe pause you in case they won't be able to access and then they're gonna cry over it. All right, what else? And maybe some more flowers over here. Let's uh, light up this corner as well, because these dark, shady corners can be pretty scary. All right, there we go. You guys don't need to... Oh, hmm. Are you guys building this? Oh, yes, you are. And... Okay, 0 0.7 days. I know you guys are very busy. You are trying to get everything done, but I am gonna remove all these roads okay here we go and where is our district center four way you're not gonna be able to build this because there's always somewhere where we are connected okay not there not here and not this one this one's definitely not connected and lovely okay scrap city let's delete this one i know they're gonna cry over this but um Okay, scrap city. There we go. Put some roads back as well. I think everything shall be okay now. We're going to have to look at the migration, obviously, as well. Scrap city, I think we wanted to have, like, I don't know, 85? Okay, district. Hmm. You have a few pots, which I don't think we want them there just yet. Uh, you can have a ton of beavers, though, so that's fine. We've got a few spare jobs. That's in the other district. Okay, so maybe we can... Well, let's just um, let them settle in before we start moving anyone else around. Okay, look at the migration again. And I think we are okay, aren't we? Might have moved a little bit too quick there. Well, they can still move through. So how about we just take this one out? Yeah, should have given it a, another second for them to just construct things. But uh, it's okay. It's fine. Now, next things we can do... Oh yeah, we can make this kind of symmetric, can't we? Yeah, that's looking a little bit better. I mean, here... No, it's not gonna work out. However, we can still do a little bit in here. Yeah, and some more flowers there. And I think that is something we can be quite happy about. Well, you look at that. We've got some statues that are now complete as well. Uh, this kind of looks like it's made out of bronze or something. Okay, so we got one second one. And the third one, lovely. So that should, yeah, give us a bit of a bit of a boost for things. All right, now, next things. Unfortunately, we can't do one of these rooftop areas over here. And it's kind of tucked away as well, kind of hidden. So maybe it's not the best of the areas. Uh, but I would like to place something in there. Okay, can you guys... Get all of this done as quick as possible. They're probably going to complain about this section here as well. So here we go. And 
Wow, that is definitely starting to look pretty busy over here. Yeah, I think we can be quite happy about this. So um, what I'll do now real quick, I'm just going to go around and and start deleting ladders in different areas to make this look a little bit nicer. Right, so before we finalize our decorations and the entertainment here, let's just have a quick look how this bad diet is going to go because I am still not entirely convinced that everything is going to be safe. So this one seems to be fine. We're blocking the water from entering the channel over there. Band water is going here, through here. And same about this little secret tile that was very annoying. Which means our new mangrove farm is absolutely fine. We seem to have some irrigation problems over here, however, which is a little bit unfortunate. Okay, let's drop you a little bit and hopefully we will start getting some more water very soon. We are leaking somewhere. I think it must have had a bit of a flood in here. And that's because we don't have any sort of cushion or areas. What's happening over here? That looks a little bit bizarre, but okay, that's fine. Then, oh dear, you guys are flooding. Everything is opened up to the maximum we've got tons of power being produced over here but we are still leaking a little bit okay so that's a little bit unfortunate of course what is the height of the water right now depth is three it's definitely an upgrade so what i'm thinking we might need yet another another row okay so that's good to know I think what we'll do is, uh, so that's going to be here, road in here, so maybe, okay, let's just do this area first, and I'll give you a slightly lower priority, because we, we have some other, other things we'd like to get done first, isn't it? The gates are closed, so that is okay. Right, let's uh, leave you for for now and moving back over here and let's see how are you guys going let's get this one built as well i just had to move the forest there just a tiny bit and um, that is to place a few extra trees over here i don't want to block this area because this is kind of like where things are not growing it's, it, it's sort of like a wind natural wind tunnel between mountains so it's like a small valley over here and um, yeah probably pretty pretty tough to grow anything but to this side I think that's where we we can put a few things we'll do some berries okay down here as well maybe a couple more trees actually going up this mountain as well we've got a few more braziers to sort of light the way the you guys are complete we're not gonna build anything else up here which means we can clear you up we have another statue up there which means we're not going to climb up there again. So this area is looking nice and clean now. This one is feeling a little bit empty, I'll be honest. Okay, something like so. And then we still need another tile. I think that should be it, right? As soon as it loads. Okay, here we go. And maybe a few more lights as well. You probably don't need to access the behind the area over there. All right, and what about this mountain top over here? Uh, let's not pause it. Resume the time and okay, we'll take you down. Highest of priorities. I don't think we need this platform here. You need to climb up. Okay, so you're cleaning up this area over there. Let's give you a quick second. Do we want to place anything up here? No, we don't want to go too far with the decorations here either. Okay, come on guys, if you can... Ah, oh, never mind, I think this ladder can go. So, before I was talking about that this area is looking a little bit empty, I think we might have a rough idea on what we want to do in here. And that would be the monument. So, Flame of Unity would be, would be cool, of course, but I feel like this might be more suitable somewhere around here. There's not a lot of... Well, there's a few jobs that this one could cover actually yeah this is where the hmm what do you think 50 metal 300 well we don't have the blanks just yet what about this one we have well we got tons of logs so i guess that's something we are gonna do in here then yep thousand science points off you go highest the priorities clean this up as well and they should get this done pretty quickly i mean we got a ton of beavers in here 
14 of them that would like to work for us. Okay, so here we go. We've got another construction hut over here, so maybe we'll just unpause you and I think there's only a couple things left. So let's start with the beaver bust over here. Highest of priorities as per usual. The ladder, they seem to be enjoying this access road in here. Okay, come on, give us a couple more metal blocks. And there we go, which means that ladder can go. Sorry, guys. And through here, we'll probably change you up just a tiny bit. Yeah, that's definitely going to be one of the points of access. Build a tile in here. And last but not least, let's get the, the stairs that we want to have in here. Oh, dear. Okay, I don't want to delete the rubble, but I would like to grab the road underneath. Lovely. So I think once they have this access, then they can still walk around. They can... They can not climb from here, but do we want them to climb up from here? No, they can go through here. Yeah, I feel like I want this area to be a little bit secluded. I don't want them to find uh, shortcuts from everywhere. So this is lovely to see as well. We've finished the or finalized the connection. And we can already see bots and beavers moving back and forth. I think in the future we might try and look for ways how we can make this even busier. I mean, we are going to play some houses perhaps in here and okay here we go we got our first statue or the monument done as well and hopefully that's gonna bring up our well-being eventually so uh yeah i think that summarizes very nicely our episode how we are building up or built up this area and it is finally completed so thank you so much for watching hope you enjoyed and i'll see you in the next episode